Hi guys and welcome to TechBase. In this video, we're going to talk about the latest Windows 11 Insider preview build for the Canary channel, which is the build 27909. This build was released by Microsoft yesterday. And in this video, we're going to cover everything that is new, that has changed, and also the fixes that were applied in this build. So if you enjoy videos like these, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. So let's begin with the video. First of all, as discovered by Phantom of Earth on Twitter or X. The shortened time and date in the system tray taskbar is completely removed from the Canary channel. And of course, it is removed from the other channels as well. Microsoft is stating that they've reviewed feedback and people didn't want this feature. I'm not sure where did they follow this feedback because in my community, for example, I saw that people loved this feature and I'm not really sure why it wouldn't be kept because it's not really such a big deal to have it there to be able to enable it or disable it whenever you want. This is a pretty interesting decision decision by Microsoft. Talking about fixes in this build related to administrator protection, Microsoft fixed an underlying issue where the Xbox app wouldn't launch when administrator protection was enabled. This may have also impacted other apps too, showing the error 0xc000142 were other errors. Related to the settings app, Microsoft fixed an issue where the battery percentage was unexpectedly missing from the top of system and then power and battery. Of course, you have to be on a laptop to see your battery percentage. Related to remote desktop, Microsoft Microsoft fixed an issue causing extreme graphical distortion and rendering issues using remote desktop on ARM64 PCs in the last couple of builds. They also fixed a high-hitting PCAASVC.dll crash in the previous build. They also fixed an underlying issue where if you disconnected the device you were casting to from outside of media player, the media player will still show an option to disconnect from the device. And they also fixed an issue which was causing remote credential guard scenarios between the latest Windows 11 builds and server 2022 to fail. Related to some known issues from the previous builds, for example related to display settings, Microsoft still hasn't fixed this. They're still investigating it. So I think this is pretty funny how they weren't able to fix this in a week because they had weak time between builds. Yeah, in my opinion, the Canary channel continues to be a disappointment, but hopefully Microsoft will get it on the right track in the near future. Of course, for additional information and uh, previously known known issues, you can check out the article below or the official Microsoft blog post. This is the build for today, the Canary build 27909. Not anything too interesting in it, but of course, it is a new build. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. As you matter from TechBase, until next time, have a nice day.